Hey everybody, we are back with another Team 4 on our install. Today we're going to be installing this Trail Standard Off-Road Grill onto our white Toyota 4Runner. Now, the goal is to give it kind of a TRD Pro-esque look, but we opted in for the white grill to maintain that color matched look that we're going after. So, let's get to it. Alrighty, everything is out of the box. Here's a kind of a first look of what comes inside. You of course have the two grill pieces, a couple of stickers, some instructions, a couple of pieces of hardware there. As you can see, we opted into the white grill to match the white 4Runner. And then one thing to note is these letters. So you can opt into getting the letters. You also don't need them if you just want a nice, clean, plain, simple look. We of course got the letters, opted in for the gray ones to provide that OEM style feel. And uh, the letters, they, they don't come installed already. So you do have to install them. So this is how they look, individual. They come with some double-sided sticky tape, peel it off, slap it on, and you are good to go. Man, does that look good. Alrighty, let's jump into the instructions. That is literally it. Uh, there's some instructions on how to mount the letters, which we just talked about, and then how to actually install the grill. So we're gonna jump right into it tools needed to accomplish today's job. Flathead, Phillips, needle nose, drill, and a 10 millimeter. So now that we've taken off this, this, and this, we're gonna have to look inside here. And there are more, let's see, let's let that focus. There we go, one, two, three, four. Those are the four we're gonna be taking off next. And again, they're the same type of clip. Pop your nice little skinny flathead in there and twist. Let's see if I can do this, boom. And they pull right out, so nice and easy. So a quick side note here, we picked up this little 10 millimeter set from Harbor Freight, and it's amazing. It like comes with basically everything you need for every single 10 millimeter bolt on a Toyota. So we're gonna be using one of these to now take off that. So here we go. Once that step is done, this whole top grill will pop out like this. And you're gonna see inside there how that slides out. So this whole thing you're gonna pull off. In total, you're going to be removing 12 of these little screws from the back of this grill. Alrighty, so that's the old grill, that's the new grill, the upper piece that is. So we're gonna toss these on now and move on to the next step. All right, the next step will be cleaning, prepping, and installing the new grill. So a big part of installing this is this piece. So this bracket, you have to take off the old grill and you're gonna wanna toss it right onto this piece. And in here, there is going to be a space, and that is what 
these two little spacers are for. So take those two spacers and you're going to want to put them and insert them right into here. So let's get started. Back side of the grill, you have all this double side sticky tape. You're going to want to peel it off, and then we'll be ready to go install it. Hey babe, come check this out. I wrapped up the grill install. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Alright. What do you think? This is so cool! Oh, I love the gray on the white. Yeah? It's so cool!